राजविंदर हेयर विद द न्यू टॉपिक दैट इज नीड एंड पर्पसेस ऑफ नर्सिंग रिसर्च नर्सिंग रिसर्च इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर आर प्रोफेशन बिकॉज द रिसर्च इज द बेस ऑफ एनी प्रोफेशन दैट्स वाई इट्स वेरी नेसेसरी इफ आर नर्स इज वॉन्ट्स टू do something innovative in our uh, clinical area in uh, in our clinical area in our administration and education then they are very aware about the research so that they can do something in the for the patient with the help of research for the students in education and in the administration the first one is to develop refine and extend the scientific base of knowledge with the help of research we can develop any theory we can refine any existed theory and extend the scientific base of knowledge for our profession and enhance the body of professional knowledge in nursing which contribute to which contribute to become betterment in our clinical practice in our education and in our administration okay then evidence based practice there are lots of studies are there done by our experts and legends belongs to nursing profession and we already have lots of uh, evidences so that uh, which uh, which give which give more confidence to us to use new practices in the clinical area okay then expansion of knowledge with the help of this we can expand our knowledge we can de uh, describe explore more knowledge okay then professional identity because of research our professional identities are there because without research the existence existence of the profession any profession not only uh, nursing any pro the existence of any profession uh, is in danger because in profession need improvement and need growth and that growth comes from where from research that's why it's the professional identity of our profession then identity identify boundaries of profession as you as you know we are belong to nursing profession if we sit in the opd and uh, prescribe the medication or in ot to do the surgery it's not our uh, uh, duties our boundaries some boundaries are there we have to provide care to the patient we can do work under the supervision of the physician we we cannot do uh, we cannot discharge the patient because uh, with our wish that's why there are some boundaries and in this way in nursing research there are there are also some boundaries if uh, for example if we want to do the study on the uh, fetal uh, female feticide then there is a female feticide is a vast area we can catch only one point to do the research that's why there are some boundaries here we can arrange our time within one year we have to cover our study within two year we have to cover our study according to time according to money according to resources we can set our boundaries and these boundaries set by the uh, research research with the help of research with the help of uh, ex researcher and expert that's why uh, with the help of research we can identify our boundaries of the profession of the nursing profession refine any knowledge exist already exist on profession we can do the research and can do improvement some improvement there might be it will uh, might be it is uh, any theory and any other uh, in theory in procedure in anything okay and eliminate old, old knowledge because the old knowledge present time the uh, old knowledge do not uh, give any benefit to us that's why it is good to eliminate the old knowledge and refine if uh, it is useful then cost effective care to patient if we do the researches we can uh, we can innovate new procedure we can new innovate new techniques so that uh, the patient stay at home in mi uh, minimum days five 
instead of five days the patient stay at a hospital three days then the uh, the time the money the services two days these two days lots of resources are saved that's why it's cost effective then enhance accuracy in technique the technique we are used in our clinical area it it should be enhanced it will be enhanced it can be enhanced with the help of research in education we uh, the, the technique we applied on our students it can enhance with the help of research then in the same in the administration also after that develop refine nursing theories and principles research is a subject which if we are interested in this then we can develop anything we can develop new curriculum we can develop we new nursing theories we can refine existence theory but one thing we have to defend we ha we have to know about how to defend how to explain our exp how to explain our viewpoint okay and you uh, when if you want to do these kind of things then first of all you have to confident about it then problem solver it is a very good problem solver research is a problem solver actually in our thesis we can take one question that is a problem and at the end we can learn lots of things and if we face any kind of problem and we want a solution for that then research is a very big supporter for us okay i think you have clear with the need and purposes of nursing research if you feel any kind of problem kindly inform me i will 